Hi, welcome back to Wig Studio One. I'm Christy. My YouTube name is Wigging with Christy, and today I'm bringing you a review of Ashtray Wig by Renee of Paris in the color Iced Mocha. This is new for Renee of Paris Alexander Couture Collection for 2021, and I just want to thank Wig Studio One for sending me this wig to review for you. They sent it to me so I can provide this content, but this is my own thoughts and opinions, and we're going to dive into this review. So Astrid Wig has a mono top, a polyurethane strip front. It does have a little bit of a lace there, a lace front so you can kind of see it, where the hairline is hand tied there. It is wefted the rest of the cap. It is lightweight density. So I immediately thought of Alva by Noriko. And man, if you know me and my channel, you know how much I love Alva. I've reviewed her for Wig Studio One in Chocolate Frost. Stay tuned to the Wig Studio One channel because I'm gonna be doing a comparison between the colors Chocolate Frost and Iced Mocha. I love this piece. I, um, I, I, I'm a fan of it. And I think this is a super great option for those of you that liked Alva but didn't like her density or her permatease. I think you're gonna really love this piece. Um, it's great, lightweight, great for the summer, great for the fall, great for the winter. I think it's gonna be great for all seasons because of the cut, the density of it. The mono top makes it look natural. Um, that is several of the comments I would get on my Alva was, if they made Alva with a mono top, I'm gonna get it. Uh, several of you said that because you like having that more of a natural scalp, right? You want to be able to see a hairline. And I think that's the one number one thing with basic caps is they can look wiggy when you don't see a hairline, okay? Now about this piece, this color does not have a root. So it's that more streaky highlight, fresh highlight look. Um, I know a lot of you like your rooted colors, but this does come in other several colors and rooted colors. I don't mind the streaky look. I did it for years. I don't mind it, but I know a lot of you like to have that root, but you're still gonna get that hairline there with that mono top, okay? So you can part it anyway because it's mono all the way over, which we'll take a look inside the cap here in just a moment. Let's go ahead and do a spin. This iced mocha color is medium brown with creamy blonde highlights. Very cute. I mean, this is how I've had my bio hair colored several times, especially when I was about, I would say 18 to 24. This is the coloring I would get. I love the chunky blonde in there. It's not rooted. Now, this cap is awesome. Very nice cap construction. It is a mono top, so you can see where those highlights are with that blocking of color. Polyurethane uh, strip in the front, so you can put some uh, adhesive here if you'd like, but it really helps keep the wig in place. So there is a little bit of hand-tied lace front there in the front, okay? 
Now, um, I just have some hair sticking through a little bit. Uh, no extended nape, great stretch, bra strap adjusters. The ear tabs are lace with some of that hair coming in on those ear tabs. That's gonna be to give you a more natural blend there at the ear tab. So it's done very nicely and it's intended to make it look like the hair is just growing um, and looking more natural. So those are wefts right in there on that ear tab. Let's go ahead and put this back on. So what do you guys think of Astrid? Um, I'm a fan. I, I don't have anything. The only thing I can say about it is the bang length is long, which is really funny because when I looked at my measurements and compared them to Alva, this bang says this is a shorter bang than Alva. However, it hits me longer than Alva, and you all know I have to move my basic caps back, but even when I move this back, it's still longer than Alva. Now, what I can say is this bang feels like it's thicker than Alva, um, so I'm gonna have to wear this to the side or I'm gonna have to get it trimmed. I do have it back a bit. I could try to do more here, but I don't wanna do too much because then I don't wanna get this popping up back here, okay? Because it is a mono top. So honestly, if I wanna wear this piece with a full, because of my short forehead, if I wanna wear this with a full bang down, I'm gonna need to get it trimmed. Or I could just wear it over. Okay, so I just have to say that is for short foreheads, just keep in mind that you're probably gonna need to get this trimmed. Um, I think the model is in the picture of the model, I'm trying to think, I think she's wearing it fully across bang. So maybe she has a bigger forehead than me, but I'm not able to do that with this piece. If I keep this piece and I want it a full bang, I'm going to need to trim it. So that's the only, only thing about it but in a way that's kind of a good thing because everybody has different sizes of foreheads. So you don't wanna to do too short of a bang. And then it's like up here on some ladies. Am I right? <laughs> so anyway, um, that's just unfortunately one of those things for me with my forehead size. I have to get certain pieces trimmed up if I'm wanna keep being the full bang um, or if I'm wanting to cut in a bang. So but I love it. It's such a great piece. Uh, don't forget to check out Wig Studio One's links down below of how you can get this wig, save money off this wig, uh, our social media accounts. Don't forget we have our Wig Studio One uh, wig support group on Facebook. I think it's over 16,000 ladies, which is like insane to me because when I first found Wig Studio One, I think there was like 800 of us in that group and now it's over 16,000. So it's just amazing We're, and we love helping women and inspiring women and their hair loss. I'm Wigging with Christy. I'm on YouTube, so if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, I'd love to have your support. I'm also on Instagram under Wigging with Christy and I share a whole array of different things, not just hair loss. So I'd love to connect with you over there as well. Again, I just wanna thank Wig Studio One for sending me this piece. I love it. I hope a lot of you love it. It comes in a whole array of different colors. So if you need help figuring out the right color for you, go to wigstudio1.com and during our business hours, there is a live chat button to talk with one of our customer service reps as well. Hope you have a great day from all of us at Wig Studio One. We'll see you next time. Bye.